Hi everyone, welcome back to the Chamber of Chess. Today I'm going to show you the game I played for the first rank in 2014. And this was round six. I was playing white. And uh, I mean, I ended the tournament with seven out of seven, but the games were kind of interesting. So this was the, the sixth one. Uh, Black played rook b6. I responded with bishop takes on f6. Takes. Bishop b5. So this move was a desperate try for me to, I mean, I know the bishop was lost already and I was trying to make the game, uh, say, ruin the balance, you know, to make it a bit difficult. Although here black has uh, an extra bishop and it's very hard for me to cause any problems. Um, the thing is that there was a very interesting resource that I completely missed out bishop c8 and uh i mean the main thing i missed even if i saw the um, this this way because the black rook is hanging i completely missed out on um, bishop takes because after rook trade and knight cannot take because of the pin so queen takes queen b6 the main variation after bishop c8 is rook b4. Bishop takes, takes, takes. And uh, in this variation, white is a pawn down with an advanced a pawn. Uh, that's why it gives me still some chances to, uh, well, to go for an equal position. The actual game continued this way here and the same way here. I could have... Uh, I could have gone bishop c8, takes, and this variation, it's a bit tricky to find, but um, that was one way also to go for an equal position. The actual game continued like this, takes, he actually, well, I mean, takes here, bishop b5, he took my bishop, takes here, rook d6, good move. Queen h4, and I saw just after rook d5. I mean, he could just. Uh... Oh, so that was the whole point. Rook takes d5. After this, um, the position is stable for black. Everything is protected except for this pawn. But even after this, uh, I think I, I was uh, I was calculating rook g5. And uh, here the king is well protected, no threats, nothing. And obviously I have to resign a few moves. But the thing my opponent missed was he went bishop d5. And due to an interesting tactics, now he misses his rook. He tried to cause some problems with a simple trap because now if I take his follows by queen e1 checkmate using the, my weakness of the first rank. But um, I found queen d3 check. So once he moves away, I can simply take the bishop, queen e1 check, queen f1 block, and white is easily winning. Black resigned, and I won the next game and got my first rank. The game was memorable for me due to this very beautiful move, bishop c8. And um, I'm looking forward to showing you some more of that tournament. Have a good one and see you soon.